I mean, I think it's a sign. Are you ready to go with the flow? Beauty! Hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. For anyone who's new here, my name is Debs, and I really, really welcome you. It sounded really weird. Yeah, so today I decided to do a little mango haul. I actually wasn't planning on doing this because... So, you know when you just have a little bit of an online shopping bill, something, something? Yeah, so I did that, and like, but I only ordered a couple of items. And then I went up north with um, Darren's family. We ended up going to Belfast, and then we went to Mango, and then I sort of got more stuff. I have a bit of an issue when it comes to shopping. But anyway, let me show you what I got. Um... I've got some lovely, lovely, lovely items, so I'm really excited to show you. Um, but yes, obviously, if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Love it if you could subscribe, join the family. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so first up, um, I actually got a few pairs of jeans, um, which I've never actually bought mango jeans before. Um, so this was one of the first times um, I got any from there. So these you will have actually seen in a previous video um, because I got these actually for, for my birthday but I wanted to show you them as well because I also got the black pair now so these are what they call the Regina Regina George you can't sit with us sorry <laughs> um, so these are the Regina they're kind of like a slouchy style and um, I'm not sure if they were like I think they're slightly different to like the original slouchy style if that makes sense you know like the one like super poofy because I feel like these aren't quite like the super poof which I personally quite like because I tried on like the original kind of slouchy style jean and they were just too much for me like I just they just didn't suit me at all um so yeah so I got these for my birthday um and I just loved them so much they're so comfortable like ridiculously comfortable like there's no stretch to them at all but because they're kind of that relaxed feel, they're just so comfortable and they're just amazing. And these ones, so I got them in 8, I am usually a size 8, so that was perfect. I found the blue ones, weirdly, okay, the light blue ones were a lot bigger. It's like they're longer, they're slightly looser on my waist. Um, whereas the black ones um, are, they fit my waist a little bit better and are slightly shorter. I don't know, maybe it's just I, the random ones that I got, I'm not sure. But I do love them, they are absolutely gorgeous see i'm such a jean person and i love wearing jeans and i wear jeans literally all the time like literally every single day so it's really nice to kind of have a slightly different style of jeans and so it feels like you're in a completely different outfit and you're not just wearing black jeans two days in a row even though you are does that make sense i think that makes sense i would always wear a belt with both because just to like cinch them in because obviously they're baggier and more kind of blah 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 so it's kind of nice to have the like cinch in the waist just to kind of you up so yeah, they're those ones. They were 39.99 euros, um, which I can't really decide if that's good or bad. I don't know. I was happy enough to get it for them. <gasps> I just tip my water over. Bear with. Okay, so another pair of jeans that I did get. So these ones, um, I was also really not planning to get these. Um, so these ones, when we, were, when we were in Belfast, I was there with my sister-in-law and we went to Mango. Um, and I wasn't really planning on getting any jeans there, but she was looking for jeans. Um, so she picked out this pair and I just saw them and I was like, oh my gosh, I've never seen such nice light wash denim jeans. Like, I love light wash denim jeans, but I can never find like light wash, like really light wash. Does that make sense? So these are just a mum style jeans, but they are such a beautiful light wash. Like they're just so light. Is anyone else like that? I just love light wash jeans. But I've just, like, I've never found a pair of jeans that are this light wash without looking, like, acidy. So yeah, I also got these in a size 8. They are more of a mum fit. Um, one thing is they aren't, they don't really fit my waist. They're a bit too big for my waist. Um, but that kind of tends to be my issue with jeans in general. Unless I spend the money on Levi's. Um, but they fit everywhere else so perfectly. They're a really nice length. They're a really nice fit. I've already decided I'm keeping them. But I will probably just go get them taken in. Because in fairness, when you think about it, like, there's probably thousands of people who are the exact same, like, clothes size as you. But, like, their bodies are so different. So, like, of course, they don't fit the same. One actually cool thing about Mango is Mango seems to be moving towards um, sustainable cotton and stuff. Which, although, okay, I'm not saying I'm amazing. I'm not at all. Like, I love fast fashion which is I know is an issue and 
I have been trying to kind of educate myself on it, or starting to anyway, and in my head I know that I need to move towards sustainable fashion, but my heart just loves fashion and just buying clothes. Um, but it's really cool that Mango have been moving towards uh, sustainable cotton, which I do think is amazing. Um, and also makes you kind of feel a little bit better about buying the stuff from there, does that make sense? Um, obviously you know that it's sustainable and it's better for the environment and all that jazz um so yeah but anyway that's this that pair um i just love them they're really really nice next up is dresses so i got two dresses in mango while i was up in belfast and oh, first one is this it's gonna be really hard to see on here because it's just not just not on me at all and um, it's this beautiful beige color um it's kind of like a knit a knit style um, dress. It is long, kind of like midi length. Um, it's like a wrap around, three quarter length sleeves, um, and it's actually just so beautiful. The material is really nice as well. It's quite, um, like it's not that thick, which I'm completely okay with, because it means you can still wear it in like the summertime, especially like in Ireland. Um, but it means it's kind of one that I can definitely move through into the winter as well, maybe with some boots or something. And it's just, oh, it's just exactly my kind of. Um, my kind of style you know um i had tried on a few of the kind of more just like stringy versions of the whole knitted dress thing and i find that knitted dresses are quite um touch all the lumps and bumps you know like even just having like a little bit of panty line i hate that like i just hate being able to see that it just really triggers me um so i previous times when i tried on a knitted dress i was like oh no i don't i don't like it um but this one because it's the wrap style it kind of ties around which adds like an extra detail which kind of hides other details does that make sense and um, i just find it's a little bit more flattering and can you can kind of get away with a little more in it i would say but yeah this is beautiful really love it also at the moment i've been wearing them just with some like black burks and it's just ah oh, so cool i just really love it so nice so that one i got that dress i got in a size eight as well and it was so it was 20 pounds which would be about 25 euro I'd say maybe not quite even but um and then the jeans I got us in a size 8 and they were also 20 pounds so again about 25 euro ish it's obviously not a direct trans like translation or whatever I don't know how unless I literally looked up the currency exchange right now I wouldn't be able to tell you but but yeah there was a sale on at the time and I think there's actually still an online sale so I will um link all of these items down below so that you can see um see them down there okay so next up is this dress which again i also got in a size 8 and was also 20 pounds so again 25 euro about that's like, like the most rough rough thing ever but is this beautiful little dress oh it is actually just so pretty it's got these little um puffy sleeves then with this kind of elasticated part that comes down to like the waist area and then goes out just into a little little skirt it actually also comes in a top. Me and my sister-in-law, when we were in Mango, um, we were just kind of looking around ourselves. I picked out the dress and she picked out the top, literally just completely separate from each other. Um, and then we came and then we were kind of came back together to like show each other what we picked. And we were like, <laughs> which is kind of funny, but but yeah, it's just so pretty. It's such, such lovely colors with the yellow and the pink. I mean, yellow and the purple rather. And obviously with a bit of green leaf as well, but it's just so lovely and summery and really flowy so I got this in a size small um, and I found it was maybe slightly bigger than now that I've washed it I think it has shrunk slightly because I have worn it a few times and um, it has shrunk slightly which means I think it probably it fits a bit better now and um, but I probably could have gone for an extra small so just be aware of that like it's on the looser side it's not like super tight which is actually also why I love it because it's kind of loose and relaxed and um, I feel so comfortable in it which is really nice I can just wear it for so many different occasions which is very very important so next up I got a top this is part of the online order I did um and so when I saw this I've been loving the whole padded shoulder and um, tea thing that's going around I saw this and I was like oh that's so pretty like a lovely beigey color um but when it came it's like really sparkly I'm not sure if you can see because if I go close it'll just be out of focus but um, it's kind of sparkly it's got like little gold sparkles, which I don't mind actually, like I still quite like, but obviously it means it's slightly more of like a fancy occasion kind of a tea. So for that reason, because I thought it was more casual, I got it in a medium because I wanted it to be a bit more 
kind of relaxed and loose fitting but it firstly just didn't fit I don't think it fits well as a medium it's a bit too big but then also it's really see-through like you can even from there you can see like the, the shoulder pads you can fully see them through I'm just not about that yeah so this one I will be sending back but it is lovely and I really wish it was I just really wish it was it would worked out well and um, but it just wasn't quite quite right I'm pretty sure this one was 20 euro um yes yeah, so this one was 20 euro and I got in a size medium and um, medium medium everyone slagged me for how I say that I think Darren's influenced me and he's uh, got me to say medium I was really excited for it so I'm really sad about that okay so last item of clothing then is this oh I actually love this so much is this blazer okay so this is a oh it's really dirty it's really dirty on the back so this is a hundred percent linen blazer um and oh i just love it so much so this again was also actually on the sale and um, when we were up north and i just saw it and you know that i love blazers i'm the biggest blazer fan going um they only actually had it in a size 14 um, which I was actually completely fine with because I always would usually oversize my blazers anyway and it actually still fits really nicely um, a really nice oversized fit the material is beautiful obviously I mean it's linen the one thing with linen it gets creased it's just part of the thing like I had I haven't worn this for a little while and I wore it obviously I'm such like I push up the sleeves on blazers and you can kind of see that it's still quite creased so it doesn't kind of naturally just fall out really and um, so it would need just a bit of a, an iron or a steam but oh, it's so beautiful. It's actually a slight off-white colour, which I really, really love. Because um, obviously white can be quite like stark. Um, but yeah, oh, it's just one I know that I'm going to have like in 10 years time. I will still be wearing this because, I mean, a linen blazer, like, oh, always will be classy. And classic. And just beautiful. So it also got like that lovely black button on it, which kind of, I feel like, is a nice contrast. And then also kind of ties in when you wear black with it too, so... So yeah, that one is, I'm very, very happy with that one. It's gorgeous. Gorgeous. Okay, so next up we have two bags. So this was actually the reason I kind of started the whole looking at Mango to start with. So I don't currently have, well, no, that's not true. I have a black bag, but it's quite old and a bit kind of grungy not grungy that's not that's not true it's just a bit worn and a bit old and so I just hadn't been wearing it because it just felt a bit it just felt a bit when I was wearing it so I was looking on mango well, I was looking everywhere but I found ones on mango that I was really liking and um, so I was kind of um and arm between two and um, one was a little bit more with um, kind of silver hardware but this one had this beautiful gold hardware and oh my gosh I just love it so much this gorgeous little like crossbody and uh, I just love it so much it's obviously quite similar kind of it, well it's like a bit of a dupe for the Louis Vuitton multi pochette you definitely don't say it that way but um and I suppose kind of like the Prada the Prada crossbody as well it's kind of a dupe dupe for those I'd say but I actually love it it's so gorgeous and it's even got like that little Thing for the coin purse and everything like it's just beautiful I really like it and also and um, this strap can come off so then I can wear it just as like a just a little over the shoulder bag which I think is really cute because obviously for like a little maybe a night out or like a fancy or dinner or something that would be lovely so it's kind of multi multi-purpose which is I mean always a win um so yeah I really really like it it's a little bit smaller than I was expecting like I can only really fit like just about my purse and my phone and my keys just about i do have quite a big purse though like it's kind of one of the longer ones so that maybe is part of it but yeah really really love this one i just think it's so beautiful and just goes with everything like black bag can you really go wrong and also i'm really happy like going into the winter with that too because obviously black is kind of just part of winter life okay so next up is this oh that one sorry that one was 1999. I'm pretty sure it was also on sale, which was amazing. Um, which obviously just made it a win because I had been looking at it for a while and it's been ironing for a while. And then when I went back and it was on sale, and I was like, I mean, I think it's a sign. But anyway, so next one then. This one was also 1999 and it was also on sale. And it was this beauty. This beauty is obviously very similar to the low bag. Um, it is so pretty, and I just I really like it. 
just really like it. You know I love a good basket bag and um, they are so practical in the summer like they just go with everything. Like literally everything like dress, jeans and a tee. What else do I wear? I don't really wear anything else. <laughs> um, oh, They just go with everything and they're just so lovely. This one's obviously a lot smaller than some of the low bags you'd see which are like huge but it's really lovely because this um, will go still go over the shoulder so you can get her over the shoulder and just have her up on the shoulder which I just love like I hate when you well, I don't hate because I have loads of bags like that but I, I do like to be able to put it up on the shoulder if I need just to like practically just have it up there um, which I really like it's got like a little kind of sack 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 on the inside to um, put your bits in and also has a um, long strap attachment so you can see maybe these little things and there's like a long strap that attaches when it came first actually it had these um little extra ties on like just leather ties that kind of just sat there and i just didn't like them so i took them off <laughs> but just so you know and then it also has this is actually a little pocket which i only just discovered not that i mean you'd really put anything in there but that one was also 19.99 like i said and i am just in love it's just so pretty I just know I'm going to wear this for like many, many summers to come as well. Like it's just such a practical one that it will just, will just stand the test of time as they say. So that is my mango haul. I really, really hope you enjoyed. Um, I'll obviously leave all the links to everything I got down below in the description box. So if any of that stuff you're liking, you can go look there. Also, I'm pretty sure there is a sale on at the moment. So it's probably a good time to go pick up that sweet stuff. Saving the coin, getting the goods I need to stop now. Guys, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.